three, two, one. All right, before we get started this video, I know the title does say how to paint, paint your interior. I will show you how to do that. But first, I'm going to show you the terrible fail I tried. Instead of painting these, I tried doing a carbon fiber wrap with a, it's like the vinyl sticker. It's the 5D. So enjoy watching my terrible fail. But toward the end of the, uh, toward the middle of the video, I'll start showing you how to start painting. Another episode of Garage Edition. Uh, today we are back in the garage. It's addition to this episode. Bam! All right. So today we have my window um, roller upper, my window switch um, panel switch has been taken out of it. Um, actually, the video before this. You see me, it's not right here right now, but uh, it's a video in a video. I'm actually doing two videos. So um, we're actually covering our door panel. I'll put a link in the description of that door panel um, with uh, leather. So I was like, I need to do something to this boring switch. Well, a while back in one of my vlogs, I showed that I bought some, not 3D, not 4D, but 5D carbon fiber. A 12, uh, 12 inch by 16 inch. Now it came with nice, squeegee. I don't know if you can see that or not. But it has a little film on it. You pull it back, um, revealing like a 5D carbon fiber. Well, I was like, that'd be cool if we wrapped this in. Because my buddy had a um, Chevy Silverado Metal Militia Edition that had carbon fiber uh, switches. Well, it was like carbon fiber like overlay and like whatever. I was like, that looks pretty sweet. So, my door handles on my truck's actually carbon fiber ish. I was like, well, we should try this. Now, I suck at wrapping. I've tried a couple pieces a long time ago. I suck at it. But, we're going to try this. Um, I'm going to get my, let's see, I got a blow dryer, hair blow dryer, um, and a knife, and not a lot of patience, but we're going to try it anyway. So, we're going to clean it with some alcohol. Um, wipe it down, you know, in better way than ain't. Um, Cause that's no oil. This thing's probably got years and years, like ten years of armor I'll build up on it. So we're gonna wrap this. Let's get started. Here's the carbon fiber. It has like a little inlay um, to make it look like carbon fiber. I think it'll be pretty good for it. So we're gonna clean it with some uh, alcohol. Now, um, you have door locks window. If you ride my truck or me or whatever, you can just start hitting buttons until you find the right one. So I'm not worried about that being on, uh, covered over. Clean the back because um, I want to loop it. You know, loop it over so it'll have a nice tight bond. So let's clean this. Now the the cracking that's just the uh, protective cover on it. It's not the actual piece. Take your trusted knife. Now I want to cut a decent enough piece so I have plenty of room. So got her piece, got her hair dryer. Now um, this is just a Conair Supermax, it's turbocharged. Um, I use when I need to draw my fiberglass quick. So let's try this. I'm gonna get to take this out of this because I don't want to be the stick nothing. Clean this real good, and let's try it. I'm hoping this has a lot of flex to it. it Seems feels kind of stir, uh, stiff. Actually, let's take this, take that off of it.
All right, so the carbon fiber is harder than it looks. I think the four, it's not really pliable. It's not, and you have to heat it up, and hell, I suck at it just laying on a flat surface. So, um, this is the best carbon fiber. I mean, unless you just want to joke and like oh, carbon fiber. But what I'm going to do is, I'll go out tomorrow. This video's not over yet. I'm going out tomorrow, and we'll pick up some. Uh, metallic silver uh, paint. It's got Metaflake in it um, because I don't want it to be black. I want it to stand out when it's on the gray. This is day two of <laughs> trying to do the carbon fiber wrap. I wanted it so it match that, but I just, I suck at it. I can't get it right and it's like I don't want to do something that looks crappy and everything. Um, so this video is really turned from carbon fiber wrap to how to paint your interior video. So I picked up some paint. I'll show you that in just a second. I want to paint my door handle and paint the other one too. Let me clean up the truck. Um, paint it um, to match. So it shows that it's just a simple bolt holding it. So we're going to go ahead and take this off. It's a 10 wrench. So we're going to take this off. Um, clean it that way it'll be paint I paint it silver so it will stick out too they'll be like oh there's a silver handle there so let's go ahead and take it off and we'll take it in a, a shop room clean it clean the other part real good and I'll show you the paint we're going to use I've got my door handle and pieces laid off uh, laid down now I bought this it's super max Krylon it's I want stuff that's a little bit of like sparkle so it doesn't look all oh, we just plant plain silver um, this is like the metallic so I've never used this it's got the paint primer indoor and outdoor maximum rust protection and no sanding bonds to plastic laminate wood metal mystery etc etc we're putting on plastic and these are actually touched heavily so I'm wanting it to bond really good I've used Krylon for a lot of different things Krylon is like one of the best now, I mean besides automotive paint and everything but um, for primer, I just use the cheap stuff. These are like 96 cent a can. But for the, you know, I use pri There's my paint thing. Need to get a lot more paint, getting shy of some stuff. But we're going to go ahead and clean these real good and paint them. I know I tried um, doing carbon fiber, and I lost sleep last night because I couldn't get away I wanted. When I can't do something, like it hurts me so bad because it's like I, love, I take pride in doing it. So it killed me when I just couldn't get the stupid carbon fiber sticker on it. it, it I lost sleep over because like, I just kept thinking about, man, I like failed myself. So we're going to paint it silver. I wanted a gray um, door panel to match the uh, uh, like carbon fiber, but... We can't, so we're switching everything up. The whole color thing is completely switched. So we're going to go ahead and paint this silver. So let's clean it. We got our. I use that to clean it. Um, seems to work really well. We got our paper towels. This part's clean, but we're going to clean it again. We'll clean this because it touched a lot. And we'll spray it a couple coats and let it dry in the sun. This might be the most metallic silver I ever seen. You can actually see the particles floating around. So I recommend if you do paint it, use a mask. <laughs> Holy crap, that stuff is like really, really silver. Yeah, so I put multiple coats on this. I'm trying to get so you can see it. 
it turned out really well everything's good um, unfortunately I can't put put them in a truck because one has to drive so I'm going to put both of them in the uh, shop to let it dry overnight it's just really easy when you paint in your um, your interior you just gotta uh, preparation is like the number one factor always like prep your uh, item everything a lot of people use like I've used scuff uh, the uh, like scuff pads because um, it's like the paint like adheres to it make sure you use the right paint too and if you do put other paint if you want to do a two-tone or something I always remember check and see if the paint is like um, uh, compatible with each other like I, if I do like a two-tone and they're going to touch I always do Krylon and Krylon but you got to make sure it's uh, compatible cause sometimes you'll read it'll be like not compatible with the Krylon satin black or or uh, red or blue or you know silver or anything uh, so because they'll react and you'll get real bad um, like bubbling and cracking and it's what you don't want so when you go um, put paint your interior it's just real simple just take the pieces out or tape them off um, and just I usually do like like a 50% cover let it dry and cover it again and just give it more coats and stuff I'm not a professional painter um, and so if you you know you but I mean it's just just try and just explore if you mess up you can always um, you know uh, sand it down real smooth and stuff and repaint it so it's not a big deal it's not uh, life or death or anything like that so if you enjoyed this video make sure you like and subscribe this is George and I'm out of here